Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to solve another Portswigger lab about OS command injection, which is a simple case. So let us see what this lab is about. So the lab contains an OS command injection vulnerability in the product stock checker. Okay, so while checking the stock, how much product is left, that is where the OS command injection is there. So this is our first clue. The application executes a shell command containing user supplied products and store IDs, return the raw output from the commands. Okay. And to solve the lab, we have to execute the who am I command. So, okay, let's access the lab. So this is the lab. Let us just collect, I mean, select any of the products that are shown. And while I click on stock, let me go back to burp, switch on my intercept. okay yeah now we got the request i think it was not clicked before but i'm not sure so yeah anyway we got the request and we see that there are two parameters that are going in here product id and the store id now for the product id i'm not sure if product id is vulnerable or the store id or maybe both of them so let's start with product id itself and what we're going to do is we're going to use an and and who am i so and is used in bash so that you can you know run two commands together concatenate them so that's what we are going to do uh, and let me just send it to the repeater so that okay. so uh, now in the repeater i can see that yeah so let us now send this request i've already made the changes and we have it here in the repeater as well so let us just send this request and see so it is giving us okay it is giving us the but we didn't get any error that we were expecting or any information as such so what i am going to do is i am going to url encode it and see what happens then so now let us send it okay yeah so now we're getting an error which is home peter stock dot line 5 unbound variable okay extra operand okay that is probably because of the store id because it is also going after the product id so what i'm going to do is i'm going to comment that and again you are gonna encode this and then send okay so yeah once we comment it using the hash we have commented the store id we can very well get peter peter is basically the answer of os who am i so we got and we i think solved the lab so let us just go back to the lab and see let us refresh yeah we have solved the lab and we were successfully able to do the command injection os command injection in particular also uh, now as it is you know susceptible to the os command injection there is a possibility that you will be able to run more commands here and there's a possibility that store id is also vulnerable to your os command injection to check that i will just copy this remove the whole thing here and then paste here and then send and we get peter again so to conclude the lab we were successfully able to conduct os injection here we understood like where like if you were doing it as a real life pen test then you would not know in which page or where the os command injection is so you will probably be checking all the input fields that you'll find so that is how you'll come across this page product id and store id and you'll try and you'll get through so i hope you enjoyed today's session and thank you so much for watching if you like this video give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends bye